Sculptor Gutson Borglum carved more than individuals into stone. Mount Rushmore was intended to commemorate American culture and ideals, a monument to democracy itself. Thus, he chose four presidents he believed best embodied the spirit of America and represented the first 150 years of American history. These presidents were George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, Theodore Roosevelt, and Abraham Lincoln. Washington was a natural and uncontested first choice, and carving began in late 1927. As the father of the new country, he laid the foundation of American democracy and is the most prominently featured on the mountain. On sculpting Washington, Borglum said, I deliberately carved the head in an upright position without the slightest tilting forward or backward or to either side, to fix upon the mind of the observer the upright character of the man. But I found the figure was too still. I merely pivoted the body by cutting the left shoulder further back into the mountain. It had the same effect as if the head itself had been turned. It has put more life into the figure. Borglum's monument, a shrine of democracy, has and will continue to serve as a lasting testament to the founding, growth, preservation, and development of the American nation.